Good morning, everybody. Welcome back, and good to see you all here for... I don't think it's our first look. I'm pretty sure I played this game before, but it is out now in full actual release. The game actually officially came out here, release date on Steam, March 29th, 2024. So just a couple of days ago this one dropped. But I'm pretty sure we played this one. Even the developers put a banner here that says uh, now in full release, 25% off. Um, yeah, they uh, emailed me and they were like, hey, our game's coming out. Do you want to play? And I was like, oh, yeah. So, um, yeah, I uh, in reinstalled it and uh, here we go. So welcome aboard. Good to see you all here. Uh, it's the type of game that uh, fills in the gap of our life simulators that we certainly enjoy. Either cleanup simulators or uh, a mix of, uh, you know, just uh, kind of building and crafting. In fact, it looks like you start with a wrecked aquarium here that we have to clean up. So certainly quite the mess <laughs> and trash bags everywhere. So anyway, good morning. Welcome and good to see you all here. Thanks again for subscribing to the channel. Welcome back to all you uh, new members, new subscribers. Hope you're all doing well and welcome aboard. We'll be playing this one for a few hours today. And then more than likely content warning a little later today. And then something a little different tonight. We'll see. But this game does seem to have uh, turtles and fish and sharks and uh, all sorts of things. Are those... Uh, oh, those are angler fish. How wonderful. Yeah. Looks kind of nice. And there's a lot of videos on this game, too, like on their Steam store page. Look look at all those videos about this game. It's been in development for a while, so I guess they've been... Uh, you, you may have seen this game before, but uh, yeah, it's now finally out. Oh, wow. 12 bucks. Not bad. All right. Well, if you like fish and sharks, here we go. Let's jump in. Anyway, one's in the chat. For the number one community out there, good to see everyone here locked in, ready to go. It's going to be a great day of and a great day for gaming. All right. Ooh, some nice jazz music right at the start. Let's do... Hmm. Let's try this. Ah, there we go. Cool. Oh, there's a sandbox mode, too, where we can just design stuff. Let's start a new story in Aquarist. Aquar 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 Aqu Age of Aquarius. Age of Aquarius. Ooh. Oh, my God. The cheesiness is perfect. I said on your 14th birthday, I have a special gift for you. You know I'm crazy about fish. It's time for you to have your first aquarium. Happy birthday. Before... I forget, here's some money to arrange your aquarium. Spend them wisely. Are you wondering why I'm so strong that I've listed a whole aquarium? Uh, well, you have to drink a lot of fish oil at a young age and you'll grow up to be like me. Uh, not only just flakes with milk. Okay, Dad. The jankiness of the game is already wonderful. I already love it. I don't remember this at all. Oh, apparently we're into birch trees. We're playing the guitar already at 14. Hmm. No TV in our room? Unheard of. We got a laptop. Bunk bed. Laundry basket. All right, press Q on the aquarium to inspect it. It's very important to put the correct type of fish, plants, and decorations in the appropriate type of water. Otherwise, they will die. Um, okay. Uh, change the name, my first aquarium. Uh, this is the dank tank. Traits. Fresh water. Oh, that's what that means. Okay. Capacity 150 liters. Temperature 14 C. Water pH 7 pH. That was my first aquarium. I got it from my dad for my birthday. It's a small but sufficient way to learn everything about the Aquarius hobby. Yep. Tab to open the shop. Now uh, buy a shovel and some soil. Okay. 
Dad gave us $600 for our 14th birthday? Damn. Dad's running drugs. Uh, where do we get soil? To go with the light one. Uh, pick up the new soil and the shovel. Oh. <laughs> that would have tipped all over the floor. Dad's going to be mad. Knowing how this usually goes, that's going to get muted, now that I think of it. Thanks, massive corporations and attorneys. You've added so much to this world. Okay, click on the aquarium and start adding the soil. Oh. Okay, this is cool. Right click to drop items. Buy and pick up a rock for your aquarium. <gasps> Dwayne Johnson? Uh, there. I'm buying that one. Oh, it's locked. Oh, we can make it larger or smaller. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, make decoration big. Hold the right and left mouse button to drag and rotate. Scroll to scale it. Bigger costs more. Oh, that's cool. After you buy it, you can make it larger or smaller so it fits the tank. Ah. That's cool. Buy and collect four items to your inventory. Okay. We'll buy a wooden stick, a column, and that should be enough. Done. Put four decorations into the aquarium. Oh, I gotta buy one more then. Let's buy a. That. Oh, the scroll wheel doesn't rotate. It moves it forward and backwards. Okay. There we go. Uh, Right-click on the decorations and making them static. Oh, we're like bolting them to the bottom. Okay. When you set the decoration to static, the item becomes stable and you can attach further decorations to it to create your dream creations. Oh. So we can like combine them to do stuff. Okay. So I can take this and like glue it to the other one. Oh, 
Um, buy a filter. There we go. Right click to inspect. Uh, enable. Ooh. Buy a heater. Fish should not produce their own body heat, so keep your aquarium at the proper temperature. Maybe we'll put it over here. Buy a thermometer. All right, thermometer next. There we go. And then... Hey, what's up, Turkish? Welcome back, dude. Bom, bom. You uploaded your first video to YouTube last week. How was my trip? That was great. I'll be posting more photos on exclamation point Instagram. So make sure you follow me right there to see. Also, exclamation point Twitch, too. Make sure you follow over there. We're almost close to 20,000 Twitch followers, chat. Less than 100 to go. We're down to like uh, 90. No, 85. 85 new followers. Thanks for the support, guys. All right, we're going to buy some fish now, finally. Let's go. Finally fish time. Buy two goldfish. Ooh. Oh, it tells you what they like. Hey, guys. Bloop. Cool. Uh, the condition of the fish is shown by its parameters. If the fish is satisfied with each of them, it'll grow and uh, give birth to offspring. It's a good way to earn money by buying small fish and breeding them until their value increases. Big ripe fish can be sold uh, for you to get even more money. Oh, we're making a farm. If we neglect the fish, it'll stop growing, uh, giving birth, and in extreme cases could die. Okay. Uh, hunger, hunger level over on the right side. Uh, fish that lack food die. Fish are happy when they are fed. Fish that are predators and they're hungry will hunt other smaller fish to feed themselves. Temperature is very important. Okay. Plants want... Our fish want multiple plants in their enclosure. Decorations are where they can hide. Some fish want to work in groups. And we got to worry about pH. Uh, if this alert appears on the screen, it means that one plant is in poor condition and is dying. You have to find which one it is and make the conditions friendly again. If that alert appears, a fish is in critical condition and is dying. Lack of O2. Okay. Click on the name and enter a new fish, a new name for your fish. Um, hmm. Let's do uh, 
Adam. We need to take care of our fish. Buy and pick up fish food. And Eve. Alright. Fish food. Oh. That's under the... The, like the miscellaneous dot 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 section? This should be like a main category, not like a side thing. Oh, a bucket. You know what that means. That's probably what we're going to feed the sharks with. Get some other fish in there and throw them in. Mm -hmm. What's up, Rola? Good to see you. Hey, Emma, welcome back, too. All right, this is food for freshwater fish. Cool. I hope that worked. All right, fish are sad. Oh. Temperature needs to be higher. Let's try 20. Looks like it's slowly going up. Let's make sure it's not too much. This definitely reminds me of, um, like, uh, Jurassic World and whatnot. I don't want it to be too high. Okay, looks like that's perfect. Alright, plants. We need a few more plants. Yeah, this is definitely a tall tank. They gave me the smiley face, so that's good. We need more decoration. Guess another column. Fish are ready to breed. Wait a while and see what happens. You just managed to breed fish. To earn money, right click on uh, one of them or inspect the aquarium. Sell fish. The bigger fish gives more money. Aw, they made a baby. Baby fish. Yeah, we're going to open a sushi bar soon from this. Exactly. What's up, Brant? Welcome, dude. So we want to sell the big ones. Something's missing here. Buy and pick up a background. Whoa. Cool. In some aquariums, you can use more panes to put a background on. Buy another background and put it onto the wall. Cool. Now they want me to buy some rocks.
Oh, put it on the background. Oh, okay. So we can stick stuff to the glass, too. That's kind of cool. Um, buy and pick up a scraper to remove unwanted background. You mean to clean the tank? Oh, we can, like, sell it. Oh. That's weird. I feel like you should be able to just take that off and, like, put it in a storage closet or something. Uh, buy and pick up a lamp. Touch nothing but the lamp? Is this Aladdin? Okay. Oh, cool. The light's cool. Alright, put a decoration in the trash can. I guess that's the trash. That's a massive trash can. That's like a laundry basket. Time to see our aquarium close up. Click on the aquarium and switch to free movement mode. Oops. It's all good. Um... Oh, cool. Well, this game's cool. Oh, wow, there's four fish now. That's pretty cool. Get out of my room, Dad! Well done, son. Your first aquarium is ready. Time to face a real challenge. I have problems with my living room aquarium. Can you take care of it? Of course, I'll give you money to buy the necessary things and you can earn your first salary. Sounds like a good offer. Level 2. Wow, we unlocked a lot of stuff. Good tutorial. Now imagine when we get to a aquarium size. Like, literally, like the downtown aquarium. Let's check out our house. Wow, dad deals drugs. The hell is that, Prague? Wow. The house is too nice. This is like the beginning of a... I wouldn't be surprised if this was actually a haunted, like, scary game. Where, you know, things start all nice and innocent. And then, yeah, look, look at how it's getting darker as we go down. Dad? the hell was he watching on TV? Dad was on NotLonely.com? This is very suspicious. What is going on? Uh, hold on. And the table's set for like six people? I can't tell what time of day it is. It's like noon but dark? Uh oh. Hi, Dad. Just gonna get this knife over here real quick. Oh, we have a nice ass house, though, really. I think I had done something wrong and all the fish died, and then the algae appeared. I don't think I'm doing well. Would you help me fix it? I would like to have. A uh, sea fish, preferably a seahorse, and a regal blue tang. Take some cash for necessary shopping. If you manage to surprise me, you'll earn your first salary today. Buy and pick up a net and... Oh, we got to get the dead fish. So dad is a murderer. Okay. Hi, possible mom or girlfriend. That looks very painful. That That foot right there looks very painful. Look at that. Okay. Oh.
Throw the fish in the toilet or the garbage can. Oh my god. All the way upstairs? Well, we found Nemo. Uh... Where's the trash can? What a weird sound effect for putting a net into a fish tank and picking up a fish. That sounds like someone pulling like a, a floaty or a raft out of a pool and then all the water like hitting the floor. All right, the panes are covered with Elgla Elgla. Uh, buy and pick up a sponge. Oh. You got your J Rail Pass ordered? Oh, awesome. Uthris is excited. All right, pick up the dirty filter from the aquarium and wash it in the sink. Dad knew exactly how to do all this stuff. He's just lazy. I'm pretty sure. You heard Lumberjack is potentially joining us? I mean, I could ask. We'll have to discuss my fees and application fees and processing and there's a vetting process as well all right pick up the hose what are we doing with the hose oh buy and pick up the hose okay Wait, are we changing the water of the tank? What's up, Omega? Welcome. Dino Diner. Oh, the bucket's for this. Well, it probably has multiple uses because it's under the food tab. Or not. I don't know. So we're, so we're changing the water of the of the tank, okay. Oh, we have to do this multiple times. Probably like three.
four times. Hey, what's for dinner tonight, you guys? Can we have Arby's? Okay. All right. All done. Use the shovel to pull out the used soil. Uh, go upstairs and get that. You want me to get a shirt that says I love the IRS? Don't forget to do your taxes, chat. Make sure you submit to the legal robbery. like two more maybe three oh no we're good oh, now we got to fill it up with water I appreciate that they put in so much detail to like literally doing it realistically otherwise I don't think there'd be much to do if you didn't actually have to like clean stuff Now we're going to have to balance the pH. You know what? Why are there folders here on the countertop? Are these for recipes? I feel like you'd put that in a little book or a binder, but actually that's a pretty smart idea. A little folder like that? Kind of smart. Yeah, fancy chopping boards, yeah. Alright, that should be enough. Buy and pick up the salt. Uh, thanks to which you can change the type of aquarium water. Okay. sea salt oh good any left over we can put in the cooking okay it's locally <laughs> locally sourced sea salt and we can go pick it up from she you know because she sells seashells down by the seashore uh, are you sure you want to change the water yeah remember that fish and plants in the wrong water will die quickly okay if you want to change to fresh water pour out all the salt water well, why don't you just reach in and pick out all the salt? Okay, so now it's salt. Uh, let's see, pick up two lamps, turn on heater, filter, put background in the aquarium wall. Okay, let's buy two lamps and a background then. And we're backgrounds. <sighs> hmm. Forgot where they are. There we go. Let's go with, uh, yeah, that one's cool. Dad, you need to sit down.
Um... Okay. Cool. Okay, what's the next thing? Okay, we got the background. Okay, we need six water plants and coral. Six water plants. also be good we'll buy like four of these and then like two of these now we'll buy two different ones cool oh look oh that's cool they come potted that's kind of neat I don't know why I find that amusing. Okay, two. This will be our third plant chat that we're adding. Third. Wow. It just falls. Uh, what's wrong? The plants are not happy. Oh, they want it to be warmer. Uh, let's go for 25. Let that warm up for a little bit. Wait, did I turn it on? Ah, gotta be enabled. All right, we'll let it uh, warm up there. If we get it warm enough, we can throw some pasta in there. Mm hmm. All right, how are we doing now? Oh, it's getting there. Plant is dead because of the temp. Oh, come on. It can't die in 10 seconds. You got to give me a second to, like, warm it up. What? Maybe they'll come back to life. I don't know. Well, not my problem. Anyway, uh, let's see. Let's do coral now. Coral! Hey, look, we're doing a lot better than Dad did. Did you see the mess? Ooh, these look cool. How many did I need? Nine? Yeah. Cool. Let's do one, two, three, four, five, six. This all looks like stuff from uh, Subnautica. Seven, eight, nine. Mm-hmm. 
I never know what to think about these games sometimes, you know? Like, there's all these Playway games that are like this. And they always seem so silly and straightforward, but then people go wild for, like, Gas Station Simulator and then, like, um... You know, supermarket simulator that everybody's been playing. Oh, by the way, I found another supermarket simulator. Oh, and Uthras is in chat, too. Uthras, you gotta check this game out. You might like this. It's literally Lawson's 7-Eleven and um, Family Mart Simulator. This looks suspicious. That that looks suspicious. Anyway, um, I gotta find the name of this. Well, let's see if it says nines in there. Yep, okay. All right, hold on. I want to check this game out. Let me. I, I found the name of it. It's kind of cool. It reminds me of that. Um, there's a game out there that's like a haunted um, Japanese supermarket simulator, but it looks like that game, but it seems to play like an actual Japanese supermarket simulator or convenience store. But I don't know how it'll play out. Well, let's take a uh, a stream break here for a second and see if we can find this game. I want to watch the trailer for it. I took a screenshot of it today. Incon Beanie? Ah, here it is. Adding it to the wish list right now. Okay. This looks like... Uh, I don't know if it's Japan, but it certainly gave me the vibes. Let's, let's take a look. Uh, Incon Beanie once... Door Mini Stories is a slice-of-life narrative-driven simulation game centered around a small-town convenience store in the early 1990s. Oh my, oh my God, they made this for me. Uh, shelve goods, engage in meaningful conversations with your customers, and explore the ways that you can impact the lives with your decisions. All right, so it's not a full-up sim, but uh, I don't know. Let's, let's watch the trailer. This could be the next big game of the year. Let's check it out. You have to like organize the sandwiches. Oh, it is. One store, many stories. All right, so it seems to be more like uh, Lake or whatever that game where you play as the post office worker and drive around the lake. But the fact that, bro, you get to rearrange the sandwiches and stack bread, which, by the way, look at that. 110, what I could only imagine to be yen for bread. That's basically like a dollar and 10 cents. Actually, I don't even know back in 1990 what the rate was, but it's cheap. It looks like you actually get to go to the storeroom. And put crap on the shelves. All right, it's probably okay. So it's going to be a narrative simulation game like, uh, like Lake. But I, I'm playing the hell out of that. It doesn't even have a release date, but it does have controller support. And it is called a simulation relaxing economy game, and choices matter. Which, it, it's funny in those games when they say choices matter. Like sometimes the choices are ridiculous where it's like someone will come into the store and the two options are like say hello or like mercilessly beat them up. And it's like, why would you do <laughs> who like there's no. Yeah. OK, turn on the filter. Let's do that. Uh, there we go. OK, uh, where's the filter? Okay, blue tang. Was it three? Three. And then five seahorse. A 
Let me start with one and before I dump them all in there and they all die. Okay, so we got to change the pH a little bit and turn down the temperature. Let's try 22. There we go. Plants, good. All right, pH and fish amount needs to change. Is it pH up or down? Up. Man, Uthras, Uthras is excited. This man's like, oh, it's because it's you got your J-Rail pass. Wait, did you say you ordered it or got it? Finding door, yeah. No shark yet? No, we gotta work our way up to that. That's the whole point of the game is to eventually, uh, you know, work your way up to it. Oh, you ordered the voucher to exchange. Oh, that's right, because we gotta go to the little, gotta go to the little office like at the airport. At least that's what we did last time. Man, the pH goes up little by little. Gonna do like three. There we go. Alright, then he just wants a little warmer and then friends. Do 24. Perfect. Okay, let's watch the seahorse. Uh, it needs to be a little warmer for the seahorse, and then he wants friends. Very pretty. You love the, the graphics. Oh, bravo, son. We could be proud of such a beautiful aquarium in our living room. A reward is due for a great job. Well done. Here's your money. I feel that you'll soon become a great, a great Aquarius. Oh. the hell is that? <laughs> the hell is that? Hello? Who or what are you? It's like a Oompa Loompa just walked into the room. What a beautiful aquarium. If you're so talented, maybe you could help me with my aquarium. My cat is constantly trying to eat my fish. Uh, who is, is this a family member or just some, someone broken off the streets? Who are you? Please help me. I don't know how to fix this. Of course, I'll pay you for the help. When you finish decorating my aquarium here, come to me and I'll take you to my house. It literally is a neighbor who just busted in. What the hell are you doing here, Cheryl? This is my goddamn stream. Get your ass out of my house. Dad? The hell is this? Couple of hoes here. Come back when your friend is ready. Oh, come back to your friend when you're ready. Welcome to my home. As I mentioned before, my cat haunts my fish. Oh, hunts my fish. It seems to me that they're very frightened. Would you like to help me keep my fish safe and happy? Oh, no. My cat threw the aquarium to the ground. <laughs> no. No. Bro, that aquarium was at least 500 pounds of water, glass, and other... No. Do you cat on steroids? What happened? Is that a croissant?
Quick, we have to help the fish and fix the aquarium for them. I mean, girl, I don't know what I could do with you. What do you want me to do? I... Girl, I'm panicking. I don't know what to do. Fill the kitchen sink with water. Okay. Mine use the net to transport the fish. Where did it spawn? Oh. This is a catastrophe. Okay, two. That cat is a liability, costing that much money. I'd say take the uh, the cat to court, really. Saw shark, hammer shark, and the bear shark. Oh no, the last fish died due to lack of oxygen. I'm so sad. Something has to be done with it. Maybe we'll throw it into the toilet. <laughs> European toilets, lol. Throw away the net. Free your hands so you can pick up overturned aquarium. All right. Wait, hold right click and then left to grab the aquarium. Oh, okay. Is this? There we go. Okay. Jesus. Buy and use a mop to wipe up the water on the floor. Wow, this game's pretty comprehensive, dude. I thought it was just going to be only aquarium stuff, but this got us doing everything. Where do I buy a mop? Oh, they unlocked the mop now. Mm-hmm. I think we should have picked up the stuff on the floor first. Oh, this is going to be a long day. All right. Uh, order some soil. I forget where it is. What is that? Oh, my God. The treasure chest. A classic. That's a classic. Oh, there it is. Mm, I like the light soils. Oh, I gotta buy a shovel too, don't I? Wait a minute. There's a QR code. I gotta figure out what that means. Hold on. Yeah, it doesn't work. It probably makes you subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell after hitting the like button. Which, by the way, we got to encourage more liking on this channel. So we're going to do ma mandatory like. We're going to be all aggressive with it.
There we go. Got to get these YouTube numbers up, otherwise YouTube gets mad. I feel like I want to put everything into the tank before the fish. Like, they give you a weird order. Like, they want you to put in the filter and all that stuff, then the fish, then the decorations. It's like, I don't know. I feel like I want to put the fish in last. All right, we got to get some lamps. <laughs> Kitty. Man, she loves her cat. I like how I'm 14, and now I've just been recruited by the neighborhood as like the uh, the neighborhood um, aquarium specialist. They do want me to put in a background. Let's just go with a color. Mm. <laughs> Jesus of Aquaria. You know, I'm just going to go with this one. That looks cool. Alright, um... We need a filter now. Can I pick up the old one? Yep. Cool. Heater and thermometer. So I can just put all the old stuff back in. Bro, look look at look at the 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 coffee and the croissant she's got in the morning. Actually, I think that clock shows it's two two p.m. Um, good. Yum, yeah. Okay, let's put water in the aquarium. Oh, you got a bucket anywhere? Now you got a Buddha. Oh, there we go. It's going to take like five trips. Yeah, maybe four. Video game news chat. Okay, that we're going to have to figure out. Big stuff. Big. All right, one more bucket should do. Eh, 
Okay. Let's do wooden decorations. What are wooden decorations? These? Dry wood? Hello. All right, let's do what what is this wood 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 root? Yeah, we'll make a pile. All right, water plants and rocks. Let's do plants now. There we go. <laughs> Game looks sick. Well, if you're into fish and aquariums and stuff, yeah. Also, this seems to be, um, even this intro just seems to be a nice, uh, it's, pr it's pretty chill. Nothing really crazy going on here. Oh, wait. Now, hold on. Before I put all those in and they die. Temperature needs to be up. Let's try 22. Alright, oh, gotta turn it on too. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, we can adjust the size of the... Uh, you can adjust the size of the plants, the wood the rocks even after you buy them mm, let's make it a little warmer let's do like 25 maybe okay we'll start with that All right, time for some rocks. That's better. Hmm. 
Okay, angelfish and goldfish. Temperature's a little warm. Do 23. Cool, just need other fish in then. Excellent. Okay. Let's see if we can add the ones from the sink downstairs. Those fish look dead. <laughs> Those two are just laying on the bottom. I think we're going to have to buy new ones. Unless magically they're alive. It's actually alive. Wow. It's just laying at the bottom of the sink. One died, so we gotta buy one. Oops. My aquarium looks beautiful. Thank you so much. You're wonderful. You deserve an appropriate reward for this. Here's the money for your work. You're a really great aquarist. Dad's waiting for you. I think he has a special surprise. Go talk to him. Thanks again for helping with the aquarium. Hell yeah! Level 4. Wow, this game's going to have a lot of stuff in it, dude. Go talk to your father. No, I want to talk to Buddha. Okay, bye. Enjoy the mess I left. Oh. Dan, how the hell did you get in here? I can see you did well. Uh, more money earned. I have a surprise for you in the future when you grow up. Be able to arrange your first aquarium shop in the basement under our house. Enough space for several aquariums. A little problem. It's a big mess there. I haven't cleaned there for a long time. If you decide that you're finished here, come to me and I'll and we'll go back home. Oh, so now we're opening up an aquarium in the basement of the house. All right. Several years later, I see what we're doing. We're stepping up. We started with the small tank, then the big tank. Now we got the basement operation. Now Dad's going to tell us to. This is Dad's scam. Dad wants us to clean the whole frickin' basement. That's the whole plan. Ah! Jesus Christ. The hell? It is a haunted game. It is time, son, for you to be <laughs> antiquated into the cult. You've grown up to take your first passion seriously and open your first door in the basement. The electricity stopped working. Seems to me that a few... Th Dad! Dad, I'm like 15, 16. You want me to, like, rewire the house and work fu the fuse box? You know how dads are just when you turn on, like, up or down the thermostat. Oh, my God. All right, Dad. Fuse box. That looks like a fuse box. <laughs> European fuses. Lol. Find a screw to repair the fuse box. You mean a, you mean a fuse? A lot of rubbish has accumulated over the years. 
Yeah, whatever, Dad. I, I already was way ahead of you. Oh my god, Dad. Save the game by using the device on the table. That this? You mean like a voice recorder? Where's the trash? Here? Oh, it shrinks it. All right. Let's see. Superman comics number one. Let's throw that out. Perfectly good uh, drill. DC Comics Rough Draft number one. Uh, let's see. Plans for an engine that only runs on water. Let's throw that out. Yeah, we're not a licensed electrician. Changing a fuse was easy, but I don't know. I wouldn't tell the kid to do that. Some of the rubbish is valuable. Find it and sell it by clicking G. Uh. Well, maybe the drill. Maybe this chair? Oh, we sold the chair, okay. Gas cylinders. Oh. Well, damn it, I didn't realize we could do that. That drill was probably worth a lot of money. <laughs> what? All right, I guess just the uh, plastic boxes then. So we're opening up a store. Kind of cool. Like eventually we work up to like a massive aquarium and sharks and all that, but got to start small. I mean, we're only 14. Wait, that could be valuable. Yep. Or maybe 15 or 16 now click to repair locker room. Ooh. Is this where the bodies are? What are you doing here? Brooklyn.
How's the trash can not full? That's at our convenience. I'm throwing everything out. I can't stand this place being messy. I could sell the to-do list for $3. Okay. Ugh, chat. It's looking much nicer. No sleep till Brooklyn. Got to do that back room too. Where did Dad go? Usually he stands around and watches us and breathes heavily near us while we're working. Now he's nowhere to be found. Okay, almost done. Couple more things. Yeah, dad's not creepy at all. Okay. Then we just need to buy a mop. Also, there's a door there. Where does that door go, dad? Oh, it's, it goes nowhere. It's literally just, <laughs> just a door. Press G to buy shelves for tools for 800. Whoa, 800 bucks for that? No, not yet. All right, couple more things. Couple more, couple more. It's going to be our storeroom, so we're going to need all the room. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Dad tricked me with the door on the wall, like how in Will Smith. Will Smith tricked me into thinking a, t a painting was a TV. Wilhelm Schmidt tricked me. And this happened. Almost done. At least we've got a window, you know? I was thinking the basement's kind of a dreary place, which it is, but at least we've got a window. And I don't, I don't think that creepy neighbor girl's going to find out that we're down here. The whole, oh no, my cat tipped over a... 500 pound aquarium, no. Here's a thousand dollars. Can you make me a new one? Chat, we're done. It's over. We're done. I think. Let's do one last check. We're good. Okay, let's buy a mop. Wait, who broke into our basement to do graffiti on the lockers? Buy and pick up the paint roller and paint... 
Oh, whoa, whoa, we can actually paint the walls and stuff too? Damn. This game goes above and beyond just like making little aquariums. We can actually like paint the basement. That's sweet. Which means that if we go down the route of owning like a fish store or an aquarium store or whatever, or operating our own aquarium like as a museum, I'm so triggered by that orange paint. Anyway. I'm going to keep the posters, because why not? Actually, can I move them? Oh, I can. <gasps> Sweet. Can I put them on the wall? No. Oh. We only put them in the trash. Sad. I wanted to, like... Move them and uh, put them on another wall. Yes, not. All right, paint roller time. Ooh. I don't know if I want to paint the walls. Yellow is a horrible color. Red, I don't know if that fits. Blue is too cliche. Green, maybe? Oh, God. Oh. Oh, that's horrible. Who the hell would do that? God. Buy a new floor pattern. Or maybe the floor will turn out better. Wood, which is... That, that looks horrible. And no. Well, we have to buy one. Is this going to change the whole floor? Maybe I'll put it like here. Oh my god. Buy a decoration for your store and set it up. I don't like the forced tape, paint a wall, change your floor. I liked it before. It was nicer before. It had, we needed to change nothing. It was perfect. Where's the roller? Wait. Is there a way I can change the color? Damn. Thought I could maybe... <sighs> Alright, buy a decoration there. This thing's going to die with no natural light. Buy a new wool pattern and set it up. Oh, here we go. Oh, like we could set up plaster or brick. Oh, I'm, I'm switching it back to brick. The brick is all right. Not that bad. Oh, thank God. Uh, change more materials on the wall. One out of four. Paint the wall. No! Stop with the forced ugliness. Stop it. This is fine. It's a basement. <sighs> All right, fine. Maybe I'll go with the white plaster. We'll do. We'll do an accent wall. Maybe. In the in the storeroom. Wait. Actually, wait. Can is this is used up when you buy it, or when you use it? Maybe we could put the brick in here, but I don't like the floor.
game is now torture. I'm going to buy like, I don't know, five of these at a time. What is this? Marble? The hell? Like a bank. I'm going to start with six. Whatever. Okay, now they got me. Okay, all right. Okay. Okay. Now they got me locked in. Okay, I'll keep the wall with the lockers brick. Right there. This one will change. I just need to buy maybe... Let's try four more. It looks nice. Okay. It's looking better now. They're giving us more options. I'll start with three. Good. And I like the brick like that. That's fine. The floor is ha horrible. Okay, then we can paint the walls. So we'll do maybe a blue section somewhere. Actually, wait a minute. I got I got a way around this. I got I got a way around this. Wait, where's that paint? All right, we're gonna hate this, but just 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 trust me. Have a good sense of decoration, correct. Where's the shark tank? We're working on that. Dad just gave us the basement to open up our own aquarium. So we should be selling sharks by noon. Wait, is that canceling that out? Oh, there we go. Store looks much better. You can finish cleaning in your free time, but now it's time to take care of aquariums. All right. Well, hold on, because I'm not done fixing this forced mess. Thankfully, it's only ten bucks. There we go. And I guess that's what this is for. But 800 bucks is kind of a lot. All right, click on the order that's hanging above the desk to accept the job. Who, who the hell is calling us for jobs? From now on, items go directly to your inventory and their excess will land on the table. Buy a sponge.
Oh, at the bottom. All right, now we're in business chat. Now we're in big business. I wonder if we'll have to get into the shark tank and clean that with, like, scuba gear. Level five. Ooh, we've unlocked a wooden floor. Three left for the prize. Didn't we already just like do this? Tank flipper, exactly. Hey, House Flipper has like a new lava update for April Fools. And the job. Oh, it says two left, okay. We're gonna do this four times? Give me the money. Last one. Gift from a friend. Hey! We've played this game as well. Dinosaur Fossil Hunter. This is the one I mentioned the other day where you actually literally get to go out to the field and, like, dig up dinosaur bones, then bring them back to the museum, and then you further clean them and sort them, and then you actually can assemble dinosaurs and stuff. That's cool. What the hell is this? I guess I can't claim it yet? All right. Oh, there we go. Oh, cool. We could put little dinosaurs in there. Nice. So they had a reference to their other game by giving you some stuff that was, like, from prehistoric times. Cool. green go uh you can like put bricks back on the wall and it like deletes it all right we unlocked new fish cool move one of the neglected aquariums to the work table uh that looks pretty neglected to me Ah, so we got to get it all fully operational. Okay, let's buy a net. Get the old fish out of there.
So this is essentially tank flipper. Okay, let's drain the water. Sixteenth will work. All right. Interesting. Can you connect the hose from the tank to the sink? No. You have to use this bucket. Also, I wonder what the time means in the upper right corner. Like, it says it's like 5 o'clock, but maybe when we officially open, customers will come in or something. Maybe they'll pay to see our fish. Alright, let's get all this stuff out of here. Now, is this dead or what? Oh, it's actually alive. Can I, like, make it a potted plant? I'd like to hold on to these and not throw them out, but I don't think I have the space to store them. And I can't right click to throw them. Hmm. Hmm. Actually, we can keep those in there. Well, no, wait. We have to put new soil in the aquarium. Do I have to take these out to do that? Maybe that doesn't matter. Funny that these are still alive though. All right, well, let's clean the tank so we can see what we're doing. Yeah, House Slipper is a fun game. Power Wash Sim 2. shovel oh those plants are gonna die one of them already looks dead but you know we'll just do what it says whatever it says we'll just do
Which house fl flippers have we played? Well, like the first game and a lot of the DLCs and the second game too. Second game's great. A huge improvement on the first game. Like they did a great job with the second game. Really, really good. Okay, uh, pour water into the aquarium. Interesting. That's the value of the uh, aquarium when we sell it. This one's 256 bucks. This one almost doubled the damn value. Okay. That's kind of cool that it tells you more about that. No, we won't play more Broken Arrow. There's nothing to play at the moment. We'll play the game when it comes out. But if you guys want to see what we're doing next on the channel, exclamation point schedule or check down below in the description. A whole list of things for the next uh, few weeks are listed and locked in, ready to go. Locked in. Locked in. Is that full? Maybe I can... I think that's full. Aquarium is full. Okay. Now, let's see. You want me to add a background? Oh, that's cool. I like that one. These plants are so dead. That's so dumb that they like die so quickly. I think they need to chill out a little bit on the plant death. Because when you're doing this, you're kind of just doing stuff in order. Also, this is dirty. Let's clean this off. This will get us more money and it might be more effective too. filter All right, and then, oh, we don't have a thermometer, do we? We do. Did I miss a scoop of gravel? Uh, I don't think I can add any more. Oh, we could che we could check it. No, it won't let me add any more. All right, what next? Uh, put lamps. Turn on heater filter. Buy fish of many different freshwater species. Times three. 
Well, all right, let's turn on the heater then. Twenty two seems like a good temperature. Turn on the filter. Sweet. Is the temp too low for the plants? Yeah, it is. But what's interesting is that, you know, you put those plants in there. It takes you a while to fill up the water. I guess the, the way to do it is add gravel, add water, and then immediately turn on the heater. But I don't even know if that's enough time, but whatever. It's all good. I could buy new plants, but uh, we'll give it a try in the next one and see if it makes a difference. Um, yeah, lamps. Lamps. Can I go this way? Yeah, okay. Seems cool. Okay, so then we just need three fish. Let's do... Um, this one. Wait. Oh, I don't know if it'll fit in there. I don't know what the size of this tank is. 350 liters? Mm. Is there a way to tell? 450, okay. We can buy that fish. pH is 5.5 to 7. Start with one and monitor. Oh. pH is good. Temperature needs to be a lot higher. He likes really warm water, yeah. There we go. Hopefully it's not too hot. Oh, we need three different fish types. Not just three fish. But we needed three because they also want to be happy in a group. Okay. How many viewers forgot the mandatory like? Oh, that's all right. We got uh, a security team out looking for him now. Several heavy armed patrols are looking out on their way to find him. Um... Also, it doesn't really show temperature yet, does 27 to 30. We want to have some fish on the high end. If we set the temperature to 27... Okay, it is. Then we can buy this fish, too. Oh, I gotta check that pH. Was that fine? 
Okay. And then... Five point six to eight point four. We might need to bring the pH down. No, nope. cold water. Too cold. This one we can do. A guppy. Needs more plants. Guppies want way more. Okay, so we need more guppies and then to add more plants. Okay, good. Oh, they're happy with the plants. But these guys are not. Okay. So we just gotta buy some more plants. We'll do a bunch of these. Start with four. Mm, looks like maybe two more, one or two more. Put the aquarium back in its place. Right, we could sell it for almost eighteen hundred dollars. Great. Same deal as before, basically. Let's start by draining the water. Wait, are there dead fish in there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the dead plants, I don't think, like... I just don't think we get additional money for it. So it's like, we, we could take them out, but I don't think it'll... We would spend the time doing it, but I don't think we'd earn a dollar for it. And you know how businesses work. If it doesn't make us money, we don't do it. If we can't use it for marketing or PR, we don't do it. We have to be uh, in touch with our core values, which is money. You had so many guppies. 
Yeah, they seem really uh, chill. Very uh, not picky. Yeah, we we hear you. Yeah, yeah. When companies start doing the hey, the we hear you is oh damn, you caught on to our scam. Damn it. All right. Um, here's a free coupon for zero percent off. Can you catch all the fish? Or one at a time. I think it's one at a time. So that one was fresh water. Maybe, maybe this one will be... Uh, maybe this will be salt water? Yeah. I see coral. Actually, let's... Uh, take that hose out of there. I'm going to clean these, too. All right. So this time, chat, in order to prevent any sort of plants from dying, I'm going to put the uh, water in there and then try to heat it up. Let's see. Oh. Okay, yeah, we got a staffing issue channel. Hold on, we're going to try to pull in. Staffing issue. Lumberjack taking PTO? No. I don't think I'll play a multiplayer game tonight. I think it'll be something single player. We'll see. If only I'd provide avocado toast, yeah. You know what I find funny is how the plants die from the incorrect water temperature, but not from, like, no water being in the tank. Or maybe they do. I don't know. But this side's clean. Is it? No. One side is. Will I be playing Outpost Infinity Siege? Uh, you can find our schedule down below. Exclamation point schedule. You can see what we got planned. Some things are moving around. Some things are not yet determined. So as soon as they are, they'll be on there. TBD. Oh, they want new soil too. Are there snails? Um, oh, there might be. Every time we level up, we've been unlocking new fish and creatures. So maybe. Perhaps. All right, what next? Lamps, background.
water. Enough. Let's buy a background. Go with that one. Cool. All right, water, and then we gotta like fire up the heater. So the plants don't die. That looks like it's going to be about 25. Alright, let's try not to let the plants die this time. Yeah, I didn't turn the heater on because it says that it's not underwater. I, I don't think it'll work. Or it might damage it. Unless the water's full. Okay, let's see if the plant is happy now. Warmer than that? Okay, now I don't want it to be too warm. And then we'll add salt. Hopefully it's not a little too warm. I think I'll bring it down to like 28. Mm, let's try 29. Plant is dead because of the temperature. Bro, these plants are so damn picky. It was off by like one degree. Whatever. What is that? Oh. It's fine. All right, let's do... Uh, Pour some salt in the aquarium. Ooh. 
The same deal as before, we just need three. And we need fish that are somewhere around 27. Yeah, clownfish will do. We need to raise the pH. We'll do it three more times. Okay, cool. Alright, the clownfish are happy. Perfect. Now, clownfish pH is at 2328. So we need a 23 minimum. Oh, looks like this is the same. Oh, no, that's temperature. 2328 for temperature 7.6. Alright, so these guys are the same. And are they okay with their group? They are, aren't they? Fish them out. Okay, cool. Uh, they want a little bit more decoration. Let's add a... We can add some shells. And maybe two more. And we'll buy a big O rock. I don't know how to unglue that from the wall. Now well, let's try these. Magic floating rock, yeah. Um, twenty one twenty six, nope. These guys will work, right? Put the aquarium bla uh, back in its place. All right. Let's go. Sweet. Uh, select the aquarium you want to sell. Press Q to inspect and then sell. I guess both.
Yay. I guess we'll keep this one for now. Yeah, we are strong. Buy a table in the next room for your next aquarium. In here? There's way more room out here for stuff. Buy an aquarium in the shop for a new place. Weird translation. Oh. Buy the cabinet with the aquarium supplies which customers can buy products. Click on the cabinet to refill the items for visitors. Oh, damn. Cool. So we're going to automatically be selling like fish food and lights and thermometers and stuff. That's cool. Uh, time shows how much time you have left until the opening of the shop. Oh. Um, try to decorate your aquariums as nicely as possible to earn as much from selling items. If you don't have time to take care of everything, don't worry. Uh, you will finish the work in the next days. The working day starts at 6 and clo shop closes at 2 p.m. The hell? This is Europe. 2 p.m. Wait, prepare your aquariums for the shop opening at 2 p.m. Wait, we wake up at 6, we get the shop ready, and we open at 2? Still weird. That's still weird. Um... Also, now I, on second thought, I wish we would have kept that other aquarium because then I could have uh, maybe used it as a decoration for customers. Nah, we needed the cash. We were broke. Okay, well, let's make another aquarium then. Let's do another fresh water since we have the salt water. Yeah, we have to open the store by two. Weird. Well, we are in Europe after all. Oh, we're out of gravel. I didn't know it could run out. Oh, it, it disappears. Okay. Um, what do we need next? Water? Yeah, I'll put the water in there, then we'll figure out the plant situation. I can buy more products I, I don't know how we're gonna make more money I guess maybe the the products are a passive income and then like we're always gonna be making money so that way we can always have cash to make aquariums okay let's buy a Filter. What's the difference? I guess one's for bigger tanks, but I don't know how big. Heater. Some of these really depend on the size of the tank, but I have no idea... Because there's, there's multiple heaters, so there's got to be more than two s tank sizes. I wish it would just tell us. Okay, let's turn on the heater to like 25...
I don't know why we need a thermostat, too, if you could just tell from the machine. Where's the thermostats? Huh. Thermometer. Thermometer. Great idea for a game. Yeah, this is a pretty good game. Honestly. Now, I know eventually we can get up to, like, literally having a massive aquarium. So it's not just, like, you know, at-home simulator. Like, there's literally, you know, sharks and, like, uh, huge public aquariums. So I think we're going to keep grinding this game out and get to that level. I didn't realize it would be small-scale, too, which is cool. That means you kind of got a few games in one. At least it feels like it. All right, let's do... That one. We'll do the classic. No. Now oh, we get our money back, cool. Some of. There we go. Okay. Install some lamps. Sharks with laser beams? Yeah, we're going to set up traps for a Bond villain. Okay. Time for decor. Hopefully they can swim through there. They don't look like they're touching, but here they do. What the hell? I guess we better do it from the side. Oh. There. That's cool. All right, um maybe some more. Put in a little seashell, maybe. And we got we need freshwater stuff.
put it over here. Bingo. And the temperature is good. Looks nice. Oh, can I put in the bubble treasure chest? Oh, right. We do have one of those. Oh, we do. Oh, we got a castle, too. Chat's got to decide. What do you guys want? The castle or the treasure chest? One for the treasure chest, two for the castle. Vote now. Democracy is standing by. One treasure chest, two castle. I think chat wants that frickin' castle. Tell you what, chat. We can do both. We'll do both. Everybody wins. It's got to shoot bubbles, though. I don't know if it will. Yeah, well, I don't see it doing bubbles, but... Oh, well. I'm going to add, like, a few more plants, and then we're done. Maybe that one. Okay, let's find out what to put in here. Um, let's do the guppies. They were pretty. We'll do ten of them. Okay, we just need to monitor him. Oh, he's happy about everything but the fish amount. Okay. done. It's time to open the shop for the first customers. Go to the entrance. Wait, was it really 2 o'clock? Oh my god. I haven't even done my hair. Ah, uh, yeah. So you get... You get paid for how much... Wow, what the hell? Seven people came in and dropped $1,800? Damn. Holy hell. Darth Urza, thank you very much for the Twitch Prime sub, dude. Appreciate it. Uh-oh. Okay, there it was. First day at the aquarium is behind you. Well, man, do I really want to sell these aquariums? Because, man, if I'm making $1,700 a day from people just coming through, I don't want to sell nothing. Oh, the guppies. Oh, still need more. I still want a few more friends.
cool. Alright, now let's do some more freshwater fish. Two hundred and twenty liter tank. Oh, that's perfect then. These things, I think, eat algae. He wants another friend. And more decoration and way more plants. Wow. All right, let's get him a friend. Another one? Plants and decorations. Okay, we can do that. About uh, these, these oh sculpt. I think miscellaneous should count as a decoration. Maybe rocks too. Let's throw on like some small rocks. More plants. Um, hold on. Putting on some cool beats for the chatty chatters. The aquarium needs more wood. Should we should we put in a thing of driftwood? We could do that. Well, actually, they want more plants, but yeah. So I wonder, by the way, if like, if the game takes into account the size of the plant, like if we put in a bunch of small plants, I wonder if it's counting the number or like if there's a total size to it. Maybe the scaling is just kind of for our own satisfaction. Like the game might be looking for six, but you can make them various sizes. All right, everybody's happy. Cool. Oh, this thing's almost going to sell for two thousand. All right, what else can we put in here? Um, sickleback. Look at this photograph. Um. Sixteen to twenty for water temperature. That's a little too cold, I think. Yep. A little too cold. Twenty four to twenty eight though. This one will do.
Everything's good. He just wants his friends. Yep. Sell only fish. Oh, that's interesting. So we can have a tank that's only for selling fish. So when we come over and hit here and hit sell. Wow, let's give us 2300 bucks. Nice. I don't know if I want to sell these. Well, I guess we have to. Press Q on an aquarium and set not for sale. You can choose which aquariums to keep and which to sell. Oh, I see. Restock goods. Okay. Level six. Ooh, new aquarium. Oh, ho, ho, all these aquarium backgrounds and stuff. Nice. It's cool. Every time we level up, we just do new stuff. Get those shelves stocked, baby. I think that's what I want to spend most of my money on. Did we unlock an anchor? Sweet. Okay, we probably don't have enough money for... Uh, like another aquarium. So, what the hell happened to that light? Did I accidentally sell this light? Wait, this one's missing too. This one's missing a lamp, and so is that one on the left side. Is that a game glitch? Someone bought it. Oh, they could just buy stuff out of the tanks and stuff? The hell? That's kind of awkward. Like, what if a customer just buys your filter and then all the fish die? That's weird. <laughs> a customer bought it because they're a moth. Oh, that's what happened to the castle? Oh... Well, let's redecorate then. We do have an anchor now. Chat was happy about that. I didn't even notice the castle was missing. I want the anchor to tip over. There we go. Collect money to buy an aquarium exhibition. We need 10,000 bucks. 10,000 bucks? For an exhibition? What the hell does that mean? Well, we could at least get another aquarium started. Yeah, I guess people can come in and buy the aquarium. So we could sell both of these for around 5,000 bucks, just over probably, yeah. So we'd only need to make another 5,000 to do this exhibition thing, but I don't know if we have to pay for that thing. New job for a client. Uh, what? Piranhas? Wait, will you come help me? Oh. So we can wait for the shop to open or we can do, go do a piranha job. Well, I, I can't really resist that. We'll come back to the shop and let that run. But let's help, let's help out this lady. Hello, ma'am. Wow, damn. What the... Bro, the devs... What the hell? How'd they do this? Damn, this is like the best outdoor environment I've ever seen. In a way. That looks a little... Okay, wow. Damn, lady. Where the hell are you living? Kitty. 
All right, wait, what, what do you need? Uh, buy and pick up a hammer. A hammer? The hell? What the hell is this? Blackwater bag. Hmm. Destroy Kitchen Island. Whoa, ma'am. You're hiring me to come in and, like, demo the kitchen in order to build it? Well, this is going to be at least a forty, maybe $50,000 job, ma'am. And judging by this apartment, I think I can double that price. She likes fish. She wants those piranhas. All right. Wait, the whole, the whole, ma'am, this is a stove. You want me to, wait, what? We're getting rid of your stove and everything else? Girl, are you crazy? Wow. Yeah, we should deploy a hell bomb. Dude, we're doing kitchen demoing. Just to try to get in a piranha tank. Is she gonna like feed a victim to the piranhas? Um. Oh wait, this is this. Wait, what, ma'am? What the hell do you have planned? Are we building a stove on top of the aquarium? Like what, ma'am? I'm gonna advise against this. I know I could get money for it, but. Uh, Ma'am. All right. Well, let's see what we want next. Put soil in. All right. This is awkward. Shovel. This is way more interesting than the uh, dad's basement shop, which I don't even know if we have a permit or a license for, but we were able to somehow attract $2,000 worth of business as like a 16-year-old. And now we've been invited to a lady's house to demo the kitchen. Kid does, has done way more at 16 than any of us. Or water in. Does she want a background at all? No. Put in some rocks, okay. Here ma'am, can you hold this? Thank you. All right, a bucket now. Uh, this is going to be a while. How big is this tank? That's got to be... That's got to be like damn near 500 liters. a thousand liter tank wow yeah big enough to put a body in that's right suspiciously right now with a thousand liters we got to figure out like what we, we probably better get a good heater we got two options for heaters twenty four dollars and eighteen I guess we'll go with the twenty four it's got to be better because it's more expensive right that's how it works 
We'll get you the fancy stuff, ma'am. Just the facts, ma'am. Products can be real nice to look at. Yeah. Morgan, uh, you want to be penciled in for a midday? We got some PTO. If you want, want to be on call, let me know. P pencils ready. I feel like that heater is way too small, even for like the like a 200 liter tank. Oh, we need a filter too. We'll get the the big O. The Mega Extendo. Yes, Morgan. Bro, there's a lot... Of, I feel like there's a lot of game here for 11... What was this game again? 11 bucks? This game was like $12 on sale because it recently came out. I feel like there's a lot of content here. Suspiciously too much. Is that underwater? I can't get this thing like underwater. Is there no way to crouch? There's gotta be a button to crouch, right? Not change the depth underwater. Left control. Oh, the airship gardening update for um, Forever Skies. Yeah, I took a look at that last week. It was pretty cool. I do want to play that more. I want to. I want to start that game all over. But I have a feeling like if I start over for this update, then I'll start over on the next one. And I think I want to play it when it comes out fully. Um. Oh, there we go. There we go. Now. Now my scroll wheel works. There we go. Okay, let's turn that on. Heater. Try 25. It's going to take a while to heat that thing up. All right. Wooden decorations 3, rocks 4, plants 9. pile in the middle. Cool. And then some rocks. Let's pick a new rock type. Now oh, these ones look cool. Looks like a little campfire. It'll keep the fish warm. You can pencil me in? All right. Penciled in. Uh, water plants, nine. Now wait, are piranhas fresh or salt water? Fresh water. Okay, um... Uh, let's pick something small.
Okay. Now let's see for the piranhas what temperature they might like. Probably warm. 22-27. We set that to 25, I'm pretty sure. Okay, we're good. Frickin' piranhas. Mean looking fish. Buy moss in the plant category and spread it on the ground. Moss. Moss background? Oh. Oh no. Buy and put another fish into the aquarium to see how aggressive piranhas are. Hold on. If we're going to put that in there, I need to... We're going to put on a song for this boss battle. We're about to literally sacrifice another fish. Um, hold on. You guys are going to like this one. Let's try Go to the middle. Hold on. Not good enough. No. 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 Okay, hold on. Gotta find it. Buy a black water bag in the aquarium and click on it to make it a black water aquarium. Why? What the hell is that? Remember that fish that are not adapted to black water will die quickly. Well, there's black... There's something that... Like salt? Allows you to turn your aquarium into a black water aquarium. Inside there's many things that give the water the right color to create the conditions for organisms living in such an environment. Most commonly used ingredients are Indian almond leaves, oak leaves, catapult, or guava leaves, or dried catapa leaves. What the hell? I've never heard of this. Oh, that's partial salt water? Oh. Interesting. My worktop leaning against the wall to close the aquarium. Oh, okay. Damn, girl, you crazy. Oh, we got... Oh, oh, that's how she feeds them. Man, I don't know. She sacrificed her stove for this? Wow, okay, 1,450, and we leveled up. And we got piranhas and stuff. Sweet. All right, well, now we could definitely make a piranha tank back at the base. Sweet. That was cool. Oh, it's also known as brackish water? Okay. Dude, chat's smart. Okay, now our shop opens at 2, which is not too far away. Now we got to make a piranha tank. We've got 1600 bucks. I don't know if that's enough yet, Bill. We buy another tank, though. Um, we're making a piranha tank, though. Although, I don't know if they want a really, really, really big tank. How much water do they like? Just 150. 
So I wonder, can we feed the... Do we feed the piranhas other fish, or do we... No place for what now? Wait, what, what about right here? Oh, I know why, because we need to move this. There we go. Alright, let's try that one more again. Actually, we don't have much time. Let's see if I can throw a light on here beforehand. Ah, uh, we can only modify it if it's there. No, we're good. So I wonder what will happen if we have the aquarium open but nobody can buy stuff. Open. Wow. Two thousand bucks. I'm gonna have to move that aquarium to the middle. What did they buy? Some of the mature fish out of those tanks? I think there's a way where we can have the aquarium not sell uh, fish or the tank, but only sell the fish. Yeah, the ba the back room is uh yeah. This is this is where the magic happens back here. But clearly we got to add some more stuff. This tank's like kind of boring, honestly. This is ugly, but it's worth a lot. Versus this one where we put a little effort in. Typically these games where you put in a ton of effort onto something gives you nothing in return. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, she's so rich she just eats out. Oh, that lady, she just goes out or maybe she gets DoorDash. Oh, no more jobs. Okay. Well, we could do a job every once in a while. Okay, let's buy another tank. And we'll try to do piranhas now. Although, I guess this is where we work on stuff, and then this is where we display. So we could do two more displays. So we'll do one of the piranhas, because that's cool. And then we'll buy this table next for... Uh, Salt water. We'll do another salt water thing. So 3000 bucks should be more than enough to get started with the uh, piranhas. This game's cool. All right, so now remember, the goal after getting out of the basement is, like, eventually we're going to, um, like, go to the big aquarium. Like, this game has big aquariums in it uh, where we actually, like, go to a zoo. Uh, essentially, like, a zoo-tier aquarium. Uh, let me... Yeah, let's show this off. Yep, see? So we start from the basement. And then we get to go to the aquarium. And I'm pretty sure we get to remodel the big aquarium because it shows trash and stuff all over the big spot. <laughs> he's, he's vibing. What? You gotta cut down a tree and build a bridge? What the hell? Bro, this game has you ripping up kitchens and building bridges and stuff? What the hell? Yeah, we gotta get up to the shark. It's interesting because I think about two or three years ago, I remember this game being out, and I can remember... Like, you could do stuff with the shark. I think they had the shark mission in, because that was, like, the big big allure, like, was to make a shark tank. But I think this was maybe, like, only a secondary mission. Like, with the piranha lady. Like, we, we couldn't make our own. We just had to do what they said. But maybe now we can actually own and operate our own big-ass aquarium. Because it's, it's more interesting, I think, to have something on this level. Which I think we can eventually get up to. Because it's way more interesting to do more like a museum than it is, like, just the shop in Dad's basement. All right, we'll get there. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just, I, I just didn't want people to think I was crazy. Like, where are the sharks? It's like, we got to get up to that. All right, well, with that said, that means that we have to... Uh, we have to play more of this game. We're out of time for now, but that definitely means we're coming back for more Aquarius. Aqu Age of Aquarius. Let's definitely do that. 
So uh, anyway, uh, we're going to go live now to a new video on the channel. So uh, go and enjoy that one. And we'll be, uh, oh, by the way, I think you guys will really like this one because it's a new farming game, by the way. So uh, enjoy it. It's on the lines of like Stardew with a lot of combat and whatnot. So enjoy the new video going live right now on the channel. And we'll be back a little bit later with more content warning with Alex, Morgan, and Harry will be around. Anyway, enjoy, everybody. And we'll be back for more. Thank you very much for all the support. Maybe we'll see whales, perhaps, if they come out with a mobile version of the game. All right, we'll be back for more Aquarist probably tomorrow. This game is too cool not to uh, continue on. So more aquariums, more big sharks, more stuff. There's the link to that new video, and I'll see you over there for our live YouTube premiere. Thanks, guys, for watching. Let's go.